all, I just wanted to say that my best friend Quinn and I, we love Castiel on the show. Why, thank you very much. Yeah! Woo! And I was just curious, first of all, what's your favorite moment on the set? And second of all, what's the best thing that's ever happened to you at a convention? Oh my god. That's two bests of best. Um, you know, I had a really, really cool experience uh, not too long ago at a convention where someone asked me if you could meet anyone, you know, living, who would it be? And I mentioned the person that I would, like, love to meet, and that guy called me two days later. That was pretty awesome. <laughs> you know, um, you forget that, you know, this fandom is like, they talk about everything, and, you know, somebody gets mentioned in that context, and they're like, you know, so-and-so, you know, Misha wants to meet you, um, which I would never have occurred to me to... <laughs> just reach out and say that. Uh, anyway, that was very cool. It was Bob Garfield. Bob Garfield, a radio personality whom almost none of you know. <laughs> yeah! Were you at that other convention that I, where I said that? Uh, isn't he great? He's okay. Um, <clears throat> so, um, that was cool. Uh, best Experience on set? Yeah. I'm trying to think of a good one. I'm trying to think of any positive experience. <laughs> Pizza man. I don't, not, not, what? I'm not supposed to talk about that experience? That's right, thanks for saving me. Yes, I'm sorry, uh, there were too many bodily fluids exchanged for me to be able to talk about it. Oh, that's disgusting. Um, I'm, I'm missing, I'm missing the thread, the, the lifeline that you're trying to throw me here. She's like, never mind, don't say that, stop. Um, <clears throat> I, I can tell you this, I'm not, I'm not coming up with a good example right now, but um, we have a lot of, uh, a, we have so many times on the set where we're, where we're running up the overtime clock because we're just laughing our asses off. Um, it happens all the time. Um, it's a big part of why I think so many people, cast and crew included, have stayed on the show for as long as they have. We, we just have a great time on set, um, all the time. Uh, unless they're torturing me, and then we don't. Um, <laughs> but, yeah, I mean, I, I, I think uh, probably Richard has talked about it, um, but that scene where, where we tumble out of the um, rift and, and into Apocalypse World and, and Rich's face lands in my crotch. <laughs> It's a very, it was not a stunt, let me just tell you that. It was a very simple, very simple action that we had to do, and... No. That was not an accident, that was planned, actually, weeks in advance. The director, Phil Sagrisha, came up to me while, while, while I was working on the previous episode, and he said, Misha, um, our, um, I have an idea for that scene where we tumble out of the rift, and I was like, uh-huh, but I hadn't read the script. And um, I was like, yeah, I love that scene. And he said, um, you know, I, I think it'd be funny if Rich sort of lands with his face in your crotch. Um, would you be okay with that? And I was like, that's like, that's what we do in between setups anyway. Um, but it was, I think, hilarious that he, like, he felt like he had to check with us to see if we were okay with it. Like, of course we're okay with it. Um, but then, um, but then when we did the rehearsal, uh, it's that, that little scene, that little portion of a scene took on really enormous, not, not that's not what I mean. Um, um, it spiraled. It spiraled, and it became a much more acrobatic and, um, and much more involved multi-person, not just the two of us were involved in the rehearsal, and it went on for, it had to have been 45 minutes. I mean, Warner Brothers is like spending good money to pay people for us, like, just 
laughing our asses off and having fun. Um, <laughs> anyway. Thank you. Thank you. I could have used a heads up about this landing site. Why well, is it always got to be me that makes the call, huh? It's not like Cash lives in my ass. The dude's busy. Cash, get out of my ass. I was never in your... Well, that was fun. I could have used a heads up about this landing site. I need you to let me touch it. Touch it, touch it, touch it, touch it, touch it, touch it, touch it. I have to do it very gingerly. Keep both hands on the wheel. Oh, that was fun. I could have used a heads up about this landing site. Awesome. That's awesome. Right. Right. Come on. You know what? You're awesome. <laughs> Thanks. Um, you too, I guess. <laughs>